Welcome to the cruise chain play of Mega Man X. Click the button on the screen to start from the beginning. Hello guys and welcome to the crew chain plays. I am Yoshi and Mario and this is Boomer Kuanga. Right, let's do this. Oh my god, I have been uh I've been frantically I guess you could say practicing this level and actually practicing the game in general for the past couple of hours before I'm filming this. Uh, I have played Mega Man X before, of course, but and I've played other Mega Mans, but um, I haven't played it for quite a while. So, okay, there we go. So, you know, I was a, a to, to say a bit rusty is uh, certainly an underestimation right there. But no, I'm having fun with it. This is good. Anyway, so I'm just going to progress on through the level, keep it going. This, uh, this freaking red gun enemy, I don't know any of the names of the enemies, by the way. I'm, that's not just a Mega Man thing. If you watch any of my other Let's Plays, uh, you will know, especially Wind Waker for some reason, you will know that I am awful, <laughs> absolutely awful with uh, the names of enemies. I don't know why. It's not that they're not memorable and I'm not insulting the game creators. Oh, God, see, this is how you make enemies, Yoshi. Jeez. Anyway, okay, at least we made it through that bit. The bit with the lasers is really freaking annoying. This bit isn't too bad, actually, with these guys that drop the, uh, I guess, nuclear bombs on you. I, I don't know. Uh, just plain old rockets. That one I always skip. I don't know why. I just find it easier to skip because you've got the blockade there. But um, if you start as far to the left or right, you know, uh, away from the enemy as you can, and then just keep shooting along... Um, you'll pretty much miss it the whole time, like, you'll miss the bombs, and it's, it's easy as hell. Now this bit's annoying, as hell as well, as you can see, and I always get hit on this, oh god, okay, I'm doing okay actually. Oh, no, there we go. I always get hit on this, because I know you can predict where they're going to come down from, but I still fall for it every time. Every time! Ugh, oh, I don't know why. Uh, finally we are outside and it is all bright and sunny and joyous like it, it actually isn't over here in the UK right now for summer which sucks because I miss summertime oh my god so that's just oh god I'm going on a bit of a detour here that was just a rant of myself um, just my subconscious there getting into my let's play you know this there's nothing like it uh, anyway okay keep on going just keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. Doesn't make any sense, but it's a Finding Nemo reference, so you guys will like it anyway. Hopefully. Hey, it rhymes. I'm a poet and I kind of knew it. What? I'm cocky. Yeah. People always say they don't know it. I know it! Jeez. Okay, I need to get back to game talking. Oh my god. I do that in every video. I always love getting off topic, but apparently you guys love it too, so it's all good. It's all good. Okay, finally we're back in. There we go, there we go. I basically missed in commentary the whole outside bit I just did. But oh well, it, it's fine. It's fine. Okay, oh, I'm getting a bit, uh, I'm getting a bit stressed, I guess you could say. Now, I'm coming up to the boss. The uh, boomer is actually quite easy if you use the correct weapon. With this, I will be using the rockets, of course. Um, as long as you kind of, I have tried spamming it at the start. Uh, that is one thing I did try to do on some of the practices that I did. Um, I don't recommend doing that. I recommend dodging him for the first time because he will be quick enough to come at you the first time. Uh, dodging him for the first bit and then once you're actually out of the way you can jump over to the right side of the room and just kind of spam the rockets at him and it will almost take him down in that first try. So, I well it might actually. That's what I'll try. Uh, hopefully we can do that. That would be awesome if I didn't get hit in the boss. Because I've actually I've taken quite a lot of damage this level. Uh, it's not too good. Um, I don't think I'll redo it. Okay, here we go. Here we go, palms getting sweaty. These beat arms are heavy. What? Rap lyrics in my video. Okay, homing missile. Here we go. Let's do this. Come on, Yoshi. Uh, right, is he going to come? Here he is. Uh, right, yeah, I've got it selected. I just wanted to check. Um, I'm going to... Okay, jump over to the right side. Jump over to the right side. I fire one or two. Jump over to the right. There we go. Right, I'm just going to spam it. Come on, spam it, spam it, spam it. Spam oh, God, did I dodge that? I don't know. Uh, spam it, spam it, spam it, spam it, spam it. Oh, here we go. And just like that, guys. I think I got hit once. Just like that. 
That is how you take down a Mega Man boss. Specifically Boomer Kuanga, because that was who I was doing, and all the others are completely different, so regard that first statement I said. But, um, thanks for watching. I've been Yoshi Mario. Don't forget to check out the other Crew Chain Let's Plays if you enjoyed this one. And, uh, thanks for watching my part. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you didn't feel too bad for my fails, because I did feel f fail through the level, but, uh, hey, that happens. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you later. <laughs>